But what it does is it gives you information. It's linked to hot schedules. So you can, so it pulls in all the information you can see. And at a glance, we can see who's supposed to be working today. And we can see what time they're working today. And we can see what time they're off. And the, the most valuable feature is that OneClick also integrates their training. It knows that the queen is the best. And it knows that Cody knows cash cart. And it knows that Spencer knows cash cart. And Cranberry, she's a team leader. And OneClick knows that. That's the main value. The, the key feature is that it's able to pull in all this information and give you an easy interface to drag and drop the people around and move them from the runner to the dining room host. Or maybe if you need to make a change and send them out to IPOS and in outside, you can do that. It's really super easy for the team leaders and the shift leaders and, and everybody to pull up the app and, and plan and say, wow, Reagan, Reagan's been do doing really good right now and we need her in this specific position or we need her in another position. Another key feature of OneClick is that it has built-in break management. We can see right now that Reagan is on break and she has four minutes left until she's back. And that's information you know. We can also see very easily that Sarah, she works later today and she'll need a break. Uh, Andrea as well. And it keeps all this it provides all this in a really easy, simple interface. You'll see as well that OneClick also supports keeping track of your employees at all the times in the day. So not only at 11 o'clock or at 5 o'clock when you have your major shift changes, but you can also do this at 2 o'clock and 3. And when everybody comes in at 3.30 as well, you can easily see who's here and who's not and make these decisions. This is actually data from my store. And we can see that my team my team leaders have done this. They've gone through and at 11, they know who's here. And at two o'clock, they have put everybody in slightly different positions because people have left and some people have gone home and other people are here. And they're keeping track of that in that three, in that four. Some of the other key features of, of OneClick are that it's online. And so it runs on an iPad. I know that our store has iPads mounted on walls and other ones have, and other Chick-fil-A's have those as well. But outside of that, the managers also pull it up on their phones and the team members can pull it up on their phones at home or in the back office or anywhere. Um, this is a major upgrade. And having this technology here really changes the culture and helps you be more organized. It encourages the team to communicate clearly about shift changes and, and to actually make those in hot schedules because it shows up in one click. It gives them a, a good reason to do it because it's so easy. They'll want to to do it correctly and, and share so that it's communicated easily. There is another big area feature set in one click, and that's the training management. We've already talked about how it knows that Sydney is good on headset or that Paige is just barely learning. And the way it does that is with these training interfaces built for trainers. Um, it lists out everybody and it has an easy to use dashboard that provides everybody with little numbers that represent how good they are in different positions in dining room and in, as a runner on front counter on IPOS. And it provides a really simple interface for the trainers to log in from home or from wherever and put in that information as well. And so what we end up is with a feature, a rich data set of who is good at what and how and who's not good where. And then as you have a training manager that's actively managing these or a set of trainers that are watching this and they care, Sarah, how are you doing? Are you getting better? Um, you can review the notes and say, you know what? Last month you uh, were just barely learning from counter. It looks like you've made a lot of progress. And so we're going to start teaching you this next position. And that'll be good for us as the store because that means we have more people that are capable and well-trained in a particular position. And it's also good for Sarah because that means that she's having a fun time on the job and she's learning new things and growing and progressing. You can click to rate her on cash card or headset or any other position, or if you want to create any other position that's totally configurable and you plug in these stars and then you type the rating and it gives you a little preview of what it will look like. And then you click submit and it's done. That's it. It already hit the database. It's stored. Um, it's all protected and everything, and that's how it works. Here we can see as well the permissions. So we can see that Alora has the team member permissions, 
but if I wanted, if I wanted to go through and make her a trainer or a team leader, um, all you have to do is click the button and now she's a team leader.